I'm here to create a combination chart where we have we can see here the square footage in this line here the value and a legend down here I'm gonna go to a blank sheet and do this and we have to select the range first and when we're doing this we're doing a multiple or non adjacent ranges I hold down the control key I have that over here I want to do a combination chart I go to insert I click on combo chart and I would just choose this one here I don't like that that's the one that works because I want two data columns I have that in here I will go and I click inside here go into the formula bar type the information in the chart is done I'll enlarge it a little bit so you can see this better on your screen I go into the corner let's say I want to change this axis option I click inside here I want to make the maximum maybe 5,000 it changes the proportions there I, if I want to change let's say the color of the font there I can go over here and make it dark blue bold 16 point and even though when I click inside here the data range here that blank cell has to be there if I had done it like this I'll show you an example very quickly and I go into insert combo chart this is ugly with a capital U it doesn't make sense I will delete it this is what we want 